Folks, this is James Lafer with the Impossible Channel. We're going to be talking about chemtrails and we're going to be exposing some pictures that were actually already exposed at lifecoachcode.com. This was sent by an anonymous subscriber. We're going to thank you very much for sending this in. Actually, we're going to thank all of our subscribers. This is amazing. Folks, this was sent to Greg from in5d.com. Okay. And these photos were sent by an armed source. And what's interesting is that they prove all those, you know, all those folks that were saying that chemtrails didn't exist, that those were contrails or vapor, or whatever, you know, well, those people probably work for the government. You to know that chemtrails are real. I'm going to show you these pictures, folks, and I want you to share this right away. This is ultimate evidence that not only they are really chemtrailing our skies for quite a while now, it's evidence that they're using biohazard products. Okay, these are not just to geoengineer our skies. Okay, they are using these to do something else. Now, are they poisoning the skies? Most of you are going to say yes. But I'm curious, have you ever Googled smart dust smart dust is supposed to be a nanotechnology which is capable of doing a lot of things it's controlled by computers of course and they throw it in the air and they do whatever they want okay so they could be using these nano this smart dust you know whatever to change the molecules in the air or whatever you know produce holograms cloak objects make clouds produce clouds i don't know whatever i our, i know our skies are definitely not the same anymore for quite a while now for a couple of years or more and as the years go by you know the, the years are passing by it's getting worse now, these pictures are astonishing they are actually scary this is very scary folks i don't know what they're throwing in our skies this is not their skies, this is our skies, this is everybody's skies. And they are actually doing this without our knowledge, without us knowing of it, you know. We have no idea what they are throwing out there. No idea. And they're not going to say, they're not going to tell us. And I believe when they do tell us, it's going to be too late. So, yeah. Well, take a look at those toys, folks. Do you think those toys, they look... Um, nice like nice looking toys you know they don't look like nice looking toys they look like monster toys if i was in a hollywood movie this would be the bad guy the bad guy's airplane you know what i mean so yeah this does not look like a you know take a look at that and these are biohazard uh chemicals okay these are not like oh it's just vapor cool they're gonna cool the world right they're gonna just you know yeah cool down the atmosphere no these are actual planes with chemicals, huge amounts of chemicals and gases that are spraying, or even smart dust, whatever that is, spraying these, spraying the heck out of these every every single day for the last 20 years at least in our sky. So if you're feeling, you know, a bit sick or, you know, nauseous or you don't know what's happening, you know, dizzy, it may be because of cam training, but we don't know. We know it's biohazard, as you can see from the picture. We know it's biohazard, but we don't know what it is. You know, we don't know what it is. Okay. There are wild speculations. You know, aluminium, metals, flake metals, flake, you know, like a lot of things. They're talking about a lot, a lot of um, different uh, chemicals that they're using. And I'm, I'm skeptical, you know, I don't know, I haven't seen it, you know, I haven't any, any time, never seen what they're actually doing up there. You know, someone even gave the idea to go up there with a drone and capture some of these uh, chemicals, you know, go back and analyze them. But I don't know if this is possible because these chem, these train, these planes, these chem trailing planes, they are very high. In altitude and they usually are very fast okay so I don't know if a drone can go up there and simply capture a little bit of these particles and analyze it but it would be a very awesome idea to know exactly what they're doing because they're gonna say one thing and they're gonna be doing another and this is wild folks these pictures this is just wild this is just so they are doing something to our skies 
and they have admitted to geoengineering cooling up our sky because of course for some reason and they're not talking about it also it's getting warmer and warmer and warmer every day and a lot of people have noticed this about the warming and even Trump I don't know somebody Trump and other people you know they're they're going against global warming they're saying global warming does not exist and there's a reason for that you know but they're gonna try to confuse people right now everything's unbalanced right now so we gotta our continents are gonna shake because of this and the, the camp trailing is to cool down yes to cool down the planet so we don't realize that when it's too late it's gonna be too late and um, now I can see by these pictures there are other reasons for the chemtrailing, biohazard products, whatever they're throwing up there, you know, we gotta investigate. So if you have any information, please do email us at thatimpossiblechannel at gmail.com. We're gonna be waiting for you. And I hope to see you again. I hope you subscribe. Comment below what you think about this. It's crazy. And share, because I've never seen such pictures in my life before. And probably these are going to be taken down soon enough, because this is too much information, right? Like, I look at these pictures and I'm like, okay, this is not supposed to be on the internet, is it? Okay, so folks, thank you very much for watching, and see you again. Ha 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 ha!